For many central New Yorkers, the fight against cancer may start here, but treatment doesn't have to be confined to a hospital. Syracuse resident and yogi Theone Kalkinas offers an alternative in her second floor studio on Marshall Street. It's free yoga for all cancer fighters, and the reason why I'm doing this initiative is I recently lost my mom to ovarian cancer. Uh, in April of this year. And to honor her creative spirit, um, I'm doing this to keep her spirit alive. With soothing music in the background, Kalkinas offers Kandalini Yoga, which emphasizes breathing, chanting, and stretching. She says it's particularly helpful to those fighting cancer. Kundalini Yoga is so forgiving and so gentle that everyone and anyone can do it. So I customize my classes for cancer fighters because I feel that they need the most attention, but whatever we're doing in a yoga class, normally they can do as well. I just pay close attention to them and adjust things accordingly. Many studies don't support yoga as an alternative treatment, but they do report it improves the quality of life for those who undergo radiation. Kalkina says there are some physical benefits for cancer patients. This type of healing um, can be used as a complementary method. It is multi-dimensional and it's difficult to describe in words. It's something that you need to experience yourself. And this reporter did just that, going through the same techniques that Kalkinas teaches to her students. Inhale up, exhale down. Very good. Inhale through your nose, exhale through your nose. I'm Trey Connolly, NCC News.